We last left our hero sleeping on a dock of Greater Morrow, watching a volcano apparently erupt in the background. He undocks for his early morning routine. To look at the sun rise without sunglasses and a fish of some fish bones. Oh, uh, hold on. I forgot. Hold on. Oh, I don't need reflections on. I mean, it's more realistic, yes, but I don't need... I, I do not need reflections on. Oh, these are probably the flounder I need. Oh, it's a message in the bottle out here. I'm a coming. I am coming for you. Can I even catch anything out here? Ooh. Is this where my boat hit? I can't dredge, but it's glowing. Isn't the whole point of this game to dredge? Ooh, dolphins! Look at them go. Can I catch whatever these are? Yes, I can. Oh, I got the trophy! I want to head back to Greater Morrow real quick. I want to see. I want to see how much I have left, and also, um, my brain can work here for a second. I want to see how much left alone and what else I can get because I want some more rods. Like I don't know what these creatures are, but this will probably fetch me a good penny. Wait, hold on. Okay, I need oceanic. Got it. So I need an oceanic thing. Got it. Alright. The leg is a bit real. I might need to turn down some more graphics. I'll catch you guys in a bit. I meant you, the viewers, not the, not the fish. But, uh, yeah, I'm at 16 bucks needing left to pay off my loan. Um, I actually gave myself a second engine so I can get back in earlier. So, this is actually pretty good. Uh, hold on, I forgot. Ah! Hey, um, guys. Um. Um. Staring outwards, unblinking eyes borrowed from a larger being, but not the mind to process what it sees. An all-seeing cod. Ugh. I knew there was weird things in the water. But, uh, you know, I I'm not putting this near, no. I'm not putting my other fish near that, no. He might mutate him. He might get him infected. Like a disease. It's like Tetris, but fish. Ugh. Are you the flounder I need? Yeah, you're, you're still the flounder I need. Ooh, what's this? Are these flounder too? Those are like stingrays, aren't they? And what's this? Can I actually have this? No. Can't have nothing good around here. Ooh, maybe this... Oh, yeah, I got the book. Okay, okay, okay. What's what's my bonuses? 10% chance not to reduce fish stocks. Okay. Well, I'm going to quickly head back to Greater Marrow. Ooh, after depleting this. Yeah, keep away. There, and I'm gonna sell what I got, and maybe my loan will be fully paid off. 
And I also, I'm trying to figure out how I'm going to get more research points. You hand the grotesque fish to the fishmonger. He grins, raising the fish up to his face before inhaling a deep, stuttering breath. Ah, exquisite. He looks at eye to eye. And then, ah. Now this is the sort of specimen to liven up my day. Hmm, I wonder. He runs his fingers firmly along the length of the fish, as though feeling for something. He pushes from one side of its stomach, and a small shape can be seen against the bulging scales. He slices the fish open. From its stomach, he pulls a small piece of fabric and spreads it on the counter. It's a delicately patterned handkerchief. Now hold on, you did pay me for that fish before you decided to do all this, right? Ah, oh, good, he did pay me. 47 bucks! And I got a handkerchief, too. I've never seen that before in all my days. I'll give you this thing. I'll pay you for the fish, too, of course. It's not the first corrupted fish I've seen in these parts, so I'm sure I'll find more before too long. I'll pay you well if you find any more. Dead adjusted. Come on, I thought I would have... What? A man is looking at you through your cabin window, his face mostly in shadow. I know what you took to the fishmonger. And I'll be clear, I know he extracted an artifact from it. I need to inspect it, but not here. Mm -hmm. Meet me on Blackstone Island. Head out of this bay and cut south. I have business proposition that you'll want to hear. I'll be waiting. Nah, nap time. Nap time first. Okay, let's see what he wants. If I get a research piece from this, that'll be lovely. Let's see, where did he say it was? I think that might be it. I still want to catch these big fish. That's like a shark or something. Oh, I can catch these. Oh, it's caught again. Ah. Okay, got another caught. There we go. I'll just I'll just catch three cod, you know. In case in case he wants me over for dinner. Cause then we can share, and then it's gonna be delicious, and... Oh, is this it? Oh wow, this place looks kind of... It, it doesn't look too good. Oh, workshop. The workshop looks as though it hasn't been in use in decades. Go inside. You enter, take a moment to let your eyes adjust to the dim light. What do you want to do in here? Pick up items. You find some horrifying creations amongst the Deuterus. Sign a ruin. A symbol of the deep carved into this small talisman. It's sure to draw the attention of those attuned to it. Arterial engine. The bony blades of this grotesque engine are driven by a pulsing heart. It beats in time with your own. It's operational. Oh. 14 knots, 10 knots. Seven knots. Why would I need this? Oh, and I can return to these later, but this... Sure, I'll, I'll, I'll put that in. Ruined Mansion. Oh, there he is. The man is holding... Oh, the man is standing in the doorway. Watching you approach, he's holding an old book in one hand. It's bound in chrisman with silver ribbons. You came. Good, allow me to introduce myself. I'm a collector of many things, art and artifacts, treasures and truths, and curios that occupy the peri- I didn't know there was a spelling B question here. Periphery of desire. And you, ah, he has a face. And you have something for me. 
You give the handkerchief to the collector. He holds it up to the flickering light and he studies. Hmm. These patterns are unmistakable. Even after all this time, this handkerchief comes from an old ship I've been searching for. It sank many years ago. It carried items of great importance, as you can imagine. Retrieving them has proven to be challenging. That's where you come in. My proposition is this. I will outfit your vessel with equipment that will let you dredge the wrecks and dark depths. Find me these lost relics and I reward you in ways beyond all imagining. You need not give up your fishing career. I'll merely need a few hours with your vessel to make the necessary alterations. What do you say? Dredge, 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 dredge. An insolent decision. I'll prepare the equipment immediately. Dredge Crane! The relics you were looking for, a ring, a necklace, a watch, and a music box and key. I encourage you to ask around the towns about shipwrecks or other strange occurrences. Anything that might be worth investigating. Return when you have something. Okay, I'm back. Nap time. <coughs> Okay, so it just basically lights up at night. Alright. I was just trying to see what it looks like at night. So that's why I slept. Uh, uh. No! I tried all I could to get away from it. No! I'm injured. But I can still fish. I want the trophy. No, the trophy one's gone! Ah! Oh. Well, this is a stinky. Oh wait, I'm I'm gonna need parts, aren't I, to fix my ship? Oh look, I have a dredge hook now on the back side of my ship. I just get a. I might be able to. Yes. Huh? Wait, wait, what? Oh, that's how you do it. It's just like fishing. Only worse. Yeah, I'm gonna probably need some wood. I don't like this mini game. I don't care. Now I got some boards to fix my ship. Wait, where's the? Oh, I'm going the totally wrong way. Ooh, mackerel. One of the easiest to catch. I'll try to pull up three guys so that I can hopefully have enough money to fix my ship. So I got some wood. Oh, I didn't notice the ring up at the top actually shows you when day starts. Hold on, builder, lighthouse keeper, I'm busy. Some fish prefer deeper water, while others stick to the shallows. You're looking for something specific. It's important to know what death you're working with. The mayor is walking quickly towards you. He seems to be in a good mood, with a spring in his step. Fantastic news! Thanks partly to your efforts, Red Amaro is growing. Our town is sure to be swarming with visitors any day now. Hmm. In fact, I've granted a consent for the shipwreck to expand our facilities. The old dry dock is operational again. Also, allocated some money to improve the fishmonger services. I might have something to talk to you about soon. Hmm. Keep up the good work. We're glad you've chosen to be here with us. Ooh, lighthouse keeper has something to say. What is it? She eyes you suspiciously. All I do is ask if there's shipwrecks around, you know? Mm. There's a spot near the back of Greater Morrow where the currents carried in wreckages from the sea. Some nights you can see an unnatural glow rising from that patch of dark water. Can't imagine what's down there in the deep. So if you're looking for what I think you're looking for, it's best you just move on. Have you heard of any strange things happening? 
I see plenty of strange things from atop the lighthouse. Sometimes I don't know whether or not I can trust my own eyes. Show the lantern up so that it shines brightly onto your face. Mm. Are you really standing here in front of me? Or is that just another of the fog's tricks? Well, that's weird. Am I a figment of your imagination? Mm. See a lot from up here, you know? I saw that ill-fated boat return. I chose to look the other way. I watched an unnatural glow flicker through those windows. Whatever you've got planned, I hope you know what you're doing out there. I should go. Oh, a builder. You approach a woman sitting on the dockside, staring out to the sea. She turns to you. What is it like out there? It's difficult. It's gotta be a better sight than this town. I think I just need to get away for a while. Maybe not come back. Going backwards is a mistake, don't you think? You should always keep moving forward, moving along. I don't want to move along. It's not so bad here. I can't go back. She gazed out to sea again, lost in thought. Say, if you find me some materials, maybe you can help me move. I mean, really move. There's an island I heard about, Steel Point, just to the north. Two units of lumber and two units of scrap is all I need. I can make a new place for myself out there. You'll be vi welcome to visit too. <laughs> Just stack it up at Steel Point when you have anything. I'll pay you when the job's done. Ah, oh, thank you, but I need to fix my boat. Her, her, her wrench is shining. Took an extra space, more attachment points for equipment, and even superior holes. <coughs> We need a decent stock of hard materials for these products. Lumber, metal scraps, that sort of thing. Materials assigned towards upgrades here will be stored. So don't worry if you only have half of what we need. Ooh, new hull. Nets, rods, engines, light. Ooh. Oh! Wait, hold on. Doesn't it take uh, wood to fix my ship? Oh, I'm in the dry dock. I need to be at the ship right. Please repair. Thank you. Okay, okay, okay. Um. Cause I, I can't get a new haul until I get all these right. Ooh, rod spaces. Nets. Ooh, light spaces too. Um, let's sleep real quick. And I'm gonna go try to find, um... Hold on, Kevin. Oh, wow. Cyclopedia? Oh, here we go. Am I in the aberration tab? What has happened? Oh, here we go. So I got the COD one. Oh, there's information. Plentiful and basic, practically worthless, but enough to stave off hunger. It tells me I'm in a COD. Cool. Okay, steel point. Where is. Is that steel point? Is that steel point? One of these is steel point. Oh, whatever. Don't want to hit anything. <coughs> okay, M is where the map is. So, uh, steel points. Oh, wait. Looks like there's something over there. Hold on. Actually, whoops. Was there something on the back side of this island? Oh, what's this? 
Oh, it's the scrap I need. Hold on. It's like playing a giant claw game. Okay. Got that. Ooh! The flounder went out of the water a little. I still think... What is this? A slab of rock juts from the water, bearing symbols of a curved fish. At its base, a round shape has been chiseled away. This looks like a cod. Do I need to like throw a cod in here? No, uh, this is a uh, mackerel. Oh, look, something's over here. Hold on. All that's left of this boat is an old husk. You pull a little closer. Oh. I got me a ring. I got me a, an old iron chain. Gotta get that bling. Oh, is that what's through here? Oh, is this like a shortcut? Oh, these are the eels. I thought I thought that was a, a little a little tight turn. That's the eels, not the um, not wood, as I thought it was. Ooh, should I do it? Oh, so the shiny's here. The lighthouse towers above. Waves crash and this, all creatures, human or otherwise, would have their brittle bodies broken and thrown at its feet. Wow, that just got dark. So now I know there's a... There's a... There's a black stone thing back there. Let's see what I can upgrade real quick. So, back to the dry dock. Yeah, um... I want these out of my inventory, too. Two new engine spaces. Sweet. Now I just need... I do want a rod space. I think. Oh, it shows me where it is. Okay. That's cool. I'll just do something like that. And then for a net, I'll pop this in. Um, hmm. Engine. Oh, wait. How am I supposed to... Uh, where do I go for research? Oh, right here. Duh. Yes. The flexible fishing pole. Now go back to the ship, right? How much? Ugh. Why is it that expensive? Oh wait, it was three, not five. Why is it that expensive? Okay, first, I'm gonna go to Blackstone Isle real quick. Cause I'm pretty sure Blackstone Isle had a, an engine for me. Oh great, it's lightning too. Ooh, there's something sparkly right there. Yeah, see it? Hold on. The stone is quietly sending ripples through the air around it. I'm sure I'll touch the stone. Oh, the stone hates me. Okay. Ah! Lightning! If that hits my boat, my boat's gonna be fried and gonna. Mm -hmm. 
Hi, I know you told me not to return until I had something, but I'm here only to rob you. I'm taking this beating heart thing. I gently, I gently nudged. Ooh, but I am a bit faster though. Look at me go! Zoom, zoom! So I need a cod. All this rain is lagging the game a little for me. You're the guys I needed to see about, um, for the ring. And the chain. Grieving father. Anyway, guys, this has been Rich150. Thank you for joining me for the second episode of Dredge. Um, next episode, I might see what the Grieving Father is up to. And by that off screen, I'm going to get a bunch of money for the um, fishing pole so they can catch more things. Anyway, guys, thank you for joining me. I'll catch you all later. This has been Rich150. See ya!